Hey guys, I'm gonna be moving out of my apartment and I thought I would show you guys a little bit of the moving process because it is gonna be a lot and I feel like this would be kind of fun to document because I'm having my dad, my boyfriend, Casey, we're all helping move me out of this apartment and I wanna do like a little room tour in my new house once it's all set up, but I just feel like the moving process is gonna be interesting. So let's record it. <laughs> I just want to show you guys the current state of my room and the fact that I have to get everything out of here in two days is very very scary to me because I'm horrible at packing and I'm a procrastinator so I have not done much. Let's show you guys. So this is the current state of my room. Hello. It looks like it is so lived in still and I'm supposed to be moved out in two days. I need to clean everything, pack everything. The only stuff I really have packed is this like three tier shelf. Here's the current state of my desk and I just want to show you guys, I literally have the pickle chips from our pickle video, how silly of me. I have everything still in these drawers, insanely packed. And here is the current state of my closet. How awesome is that, that I have to clean all of this out? <laughs> I did it to myself though. I'm not even really sure how I'm gonna go about cleaning my closet and packing it up. I have so much stuff like stacked up on the top and I don't want half of it. So I need to really go through that today just to make sure that I'm not bringing anything that I'm not wearing anymore to my new house. And then I have my t-shirts and my hoodies in this side and I literally wear like a selection of those. I don't wear all of that. So something needs to get changed. <laughs> and then I wear most of this stuff. So I'm probably just going to put all of this in like garbage bags and move it like that. I have nothing done. I'm so scared. <laughs> Oh, also, I have to pack up my entire bathroom. I'm not going to go into detail about that stuff, but there is a lot in there. <laughs> I'm going to throw on some music and get this party going because I need to clean this out today and I'm trying to motivate myself and it's really hard. <laughs> I think I'm going to start with my hoodies and like stuff back there. So I'll just show you guys me getting rid of some stuff because I have a lot. Time for this to go. I don't ever wear it. This is so, like you can't even see what it says because it's so over like exposed. I just need to show this crew neck. I'm not getting rid of it, but like look how cute. <laughs> Gilly Hicks, but honestly I cut it and it's like really weird. Do I keep this? I don't know how to get rid of things. <laughs> I took a break from my room and I'm gonna show y'all what I have in my kitchen, which is even worse. I have so much stuff that I need to get into two boxes because that's all I've got for myself to pack my kitchen stuff. But so far I have a lot of like my dishes and I guess like my cutting board and stuff, but I have a lot of glass items and I'm gonna wrap those in some like towels, I think, because that's probably the best I'm gonna get. And I have like a few appliances I need to pack somehow. Let me show you. I have this Ninja Creamy, which is huge and super heavy. I have a blender. I have like a glass pan and I have a bunch of these cups down here. Um, yeah, I need to get a lot of this out for sure. And then I have some stuff under this cabinet as well. It is so messy. Like, I don't even know what was mine and what wasn't. I do have this cutting board and it's so special to me. So I need to make sure I take that. This is definitely a project for the entire day. So I'm gonna get some stuff into boxes and I'll update you guys later. Here is an update on how we're doing. I have definitely made some progress. I got everything up there for the most part, but it still looks like a horrendous mess. And Buddy is loving life just watching this. <laughs> The most progress I made today was with my kitchen stuff. I have three boxes full of stuff from my kitchen, which to me is insane because I didn't even realize I had that much. But I still have some more that I could go through and I'm just avoiding it. So I'm just tired. <laughs> Hey guys, good morning. Today is my last day in my apartment. This is going to be so sad, but also so exciting. I have so much to do still. Like, I don't know if you guys can see the background. My closet is just full of bags and boxes, but I still have things like in these drawers 
and then in drawers in my closet and stuff under my bed my bathroom like I need to go through some more things so I'm gonna be doing that today and once again I'll film it for you guys because this is such a long and exciting process <laughs> Something I totally forgot about packing was my towels and I had to wash like all of them because I've had a roach issue recently, which is awesome. But I have to fold all of these and then get them into a box and I don't have any more boxes left, I don't think, so I'm gonna have to figure that out. But I also have to pack my bedding and my pillows and my squishmallows, like I have to pack all that stuff so I might have to run out and get more boxes. I have something super cool to show you guys and it is that I am finally all packed up. So let's go through my closet and show you guys what it looks like. First off, this is the state of my room. It kind of looks like things are laying around but it's a lot more empty than it was. I put my headboard back on my bed and there's nothing under it which is so exciting. Here's where it gets messy. So here is like all my bins and stuff from like my bathroom and I guess my room but the rest is from my closet so this stuff is messy like I I'm gonna know where everything is like I organized it pretty well but I just have a lot of stuff to carry down and it's freaking me out so bad I had my boyfriend come help me pack today and he's helping me move in tomorrow and so is my dad and Casey so I guess that's my update for today it's just that I have everything packed and tonight's my last night sleeping in this bed which is exciting but also kind of sad because I've been here for three years so this is definitely a weird transition for me I also took down this like little background hanging flower thing that I made and it just looks so empty in my room it's so sad <laughs> hey guys so today is the day that I'm moving and I just wanted to show you guys everything in my apartment right now this all belongs to me somehow and I'm actually so embarrassed about it because I didn't think I'd have this much stuff but I'm just gonna show you guys everything like I'll just give you a quick look Okay guys, here's one last room tour. This is actually so depressing because I've lived in this room for so long, but okay, that's pretty much it. Hey guys, I just wanted to vlog to kind of update you guys because I have been so beyond busy and I didn't really get to vlog much on the day that I actually moved into my house, but it's crazy how much progress I've made in these few three days. But I also feel really bad because I wanted to film the process of like me and Casey and my dad and my boyfriend moving everything in, but I just didn't have access to my camera or my phone like the entire day. So I've been putting furniture together. I've been organizing my clothes. I've been doing so much and I can't wait to show you guys what my room looks like. Here's a little sneak peek, but I don't have anything on the walls yet. I haven't really like decorated much, but I've just been building and organizing. I had so much fun moving out of my apartment and I really do not miss it at all. I love this house so much already and I love my roommates. I love the new dog that we have along with Buddy, of course. Buddy has a new friend, but I want to update you guys on all of that so maybe I will do a separate video to kind of talk about it and like show you guys my room and give you more updates. Thank you guys so much for watching this move out vlog and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up and if you are new to our channel or haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you next time. I love you. Bye!